Yo, what's up everybody? This is the Platinum Knight here with another First Impressions video. And today's First Impressions video is going to be X. I remember seeing a trailer to this movie on YouTube. And to be completely honest, at first glance, I really didn't have any interest in this movie. It just didn't look too good to me. I mean, it looked interesting, but not enough for me to say, oh yeah, I gotta see this in theaters. So for a while, I really didn't think much of this movie until my uncle and his friend invited me to go see X with them. And that's when I was just like, well, okay, I mean, if I'm invited, then I guess I might as well give this a chance. And then my uncle ends up up telling me that he's been hearing a lot of good things about this film. He told me it's by A24, and the last A24 film that I seen was Midsummer. For those of you who have not seen my Midsummer review, I'll pretty much sum it up like this. I don't like Midsummer, okay? Um, in my review, I said I felt like it made up its own rules as it went along, and really, the best solution was pretty much uh, for all the characters to just leave the moment that they started seeing people falling to their deaths. So with A24's X movie, I didn't really know what to expect, but before I even saw this film, my uncle told me it's just supposed to be a really good slasher flick, and the moment I heard it was a slasher flick, I was just like, oh, well, okay, I mean, I do like slasher flicks, especially after just getting done seeing Halloween Kills and Scream 5, and so I became more and more open to see this film, and what what are my first impressions on X? It's awesome, everybody. The best word to describe X is it's very cool. Uh, this film does take place in the 70s, so don't expect um, anything modern like smartphones or something like that. Anything that pretty much um, makes it easier to uh, contact the police. I like how this movie pretty much feels old school. It feels really vintage. It's about a group of people um, pretty much uh, renting out a very specific location to shoot a pornographic film. Yes, you heard me correct. This movie is pretty much about a group of people trying to make a porno, but what they learn soon enough that the owners of the property, they're not exactly all there in the head, and they pretty much turn out to be a bunch of crazy people. What I really like about this film is this film may be just a campy B-movie, but it's a campy B-movie done right, though. And like I said, this movie is pretty cool. It doesn't feel cheap. It does feel like it has its own style to it. The kills are just brutal. Uh, there were some kills that I felt, um, were a little bit disappointing, but no. Most of the kills were just straight out mean and brutal and really, really bloody and gory, too. Some of the kills were clever. Hell, some of the kills were actually kind of funny the more I think about it. Uh, this movie does, um, have a sense of humor. Most likely intentional, too. Another thing I like is this movie doesn't take itself seriously, and that is why I will say that X is a badass movie. If you don't mind, um, seeing an old school slasher flick, if you were disappointed in Halloween Kills or Scream five, then I highly recommend you check this film out, especially if you're into horror films. One more thing before I go is stay tuned uh, after the credits. Uh, let's just say 
a really, really special trailer to another movie that has something to do with this one ends up playing. So yeah, uh, once the credits start rolling, don't go anywhere. Alright everybody, that's it for this first impressions video. That's it for my first impressions on X. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for new videos. And peace out everybody. Have a good one.